I love the ease of my world. I love knowing what I know about vibration. I love knowing that it's about frequency and that I can focus. I love the ease that I'm able to frequently accomplish. I love setting this time aside in order to find this feeling of ease. I so love knowing the laws of the universe. I so love understanding my vibrational nature. I so love my understanding of focus and momentum. I love that I can begin this day in a vibration of well being and ease. I really like knowing the sources surrounding me and everyone else, that all who I love is surrounded by this ease. I love activating it in myself in a way that I recognize it and can feel it fully and really own it. I love knowing that I will be guided to perfect thoughts and behaviors when timing is perfect for doing that. And meanwhile, I sit in ease and eagerness and appreciation for all that is to come. I'm happy about where I stand and eager about what's coming. I know that there are many who are seeking what I'm coming to know. And I'm so pleased that I'm demonstrating it in my own experience in a way that it will be evident in all regards to those who behold me. I feel so happy that I'm able to leave conditions out of the equation of my ease that I'm able to just find ease by the power of my focus. I so adore non-physical energy who I believe is flowing with ease and perfection around all that is. I love contemplating that there is this atmosphere of well-being that is focused to all of us and to the degree that we find ease and allow it in, we are experiencing this well-being. I just love it when my ease begins to expand, when I begin to feel the momentum of my vibration increasing, to where I begin to feel a sort of eagerness about things. Not an eagerness that inspires me to action right now, but an eagerness of what's coming. A sort of optimistic renewal is happening within me. And while I know that the timing of action isn't quite yet, I know it is coming. And meanwhile, I feel comfortable in this optimism that is beginning to build within me. It feels to me as if I have access to the power that creates worlds and I'm able to focus it. And I'm loving learning the balance of that focusing. Because as I focus with alignment, I can feel that I continue to allow the energy to flow to me and through me. It is so exciting to me to get into this place of utter well being and then to begin shining it through my focus in the direction of things that matter to me. And I'm adoring this understanding of this unconditional love and focus and energy that's coming to me. And I'm finding my way bit by bit, I'm finding myself more capable of not putting conditions in my way that block this energy flow. I know that I'm getting the handle on this energy flow. And I know that I am proficient, more proficient in every day as a result of my focus. Sometimes I get excited and I wanna run out ahead of it. But always when that feeling comes, I can feel uneasiness sort of guide me a little bit. And I realize that not quite yet, don't act quite yet. Sit in the knowing of this yet longer. Find the vibrational alignment of it and watch how my desire is inspiring others to behavior. I'm now understanding that my desire does not mean only that I will be inspired to the action that will then make change. I understand that my desire and my holding of this place causes more of a likelihood for others to find the same and the same and the same. So it is a larger movement than me just tapping in and doing something about it. It's me priming the pump. It's me setting the tone. 
It's me finding the place of it. It's me shining the light. It's me asking the questions. It's me readying myself. And then it's me watching the results of having accomplished that vibrational environment. Every day I love finding this place. And every day I love watching the results of the place that I've found. Every day I love finding this place. And every day I love watching the results of the place that I've found. And I am eager to get out and watch that greater expansion and watch the details of that. But meanwhile, I'm just watching what's happening in my world right here around me, right here around me. As I show myself this leverage that I am activating as I tap into this energy that creates worlds. I believe with everything that I am that I can be or do or have anything that I can influence anything that I desire. And I'm so appreciative of the life experience that I have lived that's caused me to focus upon some things that are really important to me. And right now I can feel that this is my step three moment. This is when I really understand what allowing source energy to flow to me and through me is. And I'm eager to get on with step four and I'm doing it a little bit every day. But step three is where I reside right now. This is the work for me to do. So there's no impatience on my part because there isn't anything for me to do. I'm not being called to do something I'm not ready to do. In fact, I will never be called to do something that I'm not ready to do. And when I try to push myself to do something that I'm not ready to do, that's where the vibrational imbalance comes in. So nice to know that source has my back. So nice to know that the things that matter to me are underway. And so nice to know that my work is to hold this place, to hold this knowing and not try to take the role of source, not try to be all things to all people, not try to be the heart of any movement in the sense of action, but be to be the vibrational heart of the movement that is being asked for by the masses. I understand that I'm not the only one who put desire in my vortex. There are hundreds of thousands and millions and billions of people who have put desire in their vortex that I am helping as I find and own this vibrational place of allowing source energy to do what source energy knows how to do. I'm in the right place at the right time doing the right thing and I'm loving my exposure to this life and what it provides for me. I'm in the right place I'm in at the right, right place time at the right, right time. Thing. It's me priming the pump. It's me setting the tone. It's me finding the place of it. It's me shining the light. It's me asking the questions. It's me readying myself. And then it's me watching the results of having accomplished that vibrational environment. Every day I love finding this place and every day I love watching the results of the place that I've found. I'm in the right place at the right time doing the right thing and I'm loving my exposure to this life and what it provides for me. I'm in the right place. I'm in the right place at the right time and I'm loving and I'm loving this life exposure and what it provides and what it provides. Yeah. Beautiful.